Hello and welcome back to the channel everybody. I hope you guys are doing great. Today I have a kind of a fun video that was taken from one of the streams earlier this week. This was a Hazard 4 stream where I was just holding open lobbies so anybody could hop in and play. We got to play with a lot of different people. It was super fun. And one thing that I was suggested was trying to do a secondary only mission by one of the viewers of the stream. So I figured that would be fun. I took the crossbow with bodkin points on my scout and uh, the only other things that I was allowed to use, at least in my opinion, that nobody really set up any rules for this. So grappling hook, flare launcher, uh, pickaxe, those type of things was what I was allowed to use. And that was about it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was a lot of fun to make. And tell me if you'd like to see more videos like this, especially ones from the streams. They're always very entertaining. Pretty good mental. How are you? I hope you're doing I'm well. I'm glad we have someone to carry our rocks and stones. Have you tried blistering necrosis with the breach cutter engineer? It feels so good. Uh, no. I haven't really. Well, I mean, I don't know if I've been using blistering necrosis since somebody's been playing breach cutter engineer. Maybe, or vice versa. I just started the game about a week ago. Can't wait to unlock the other weapons. Awesome. Yeah, the other weapons are really fun. I mean, all the weapons in this game are quite fun. But it is nice to have uh, some variety in there, too. What the heck? What's with the lagging? Huh. It doesn't look like he has, like, a ping issue. He's at 90, so... Oh, it's up there. Like crazy, yeah, you are. Beg it. <laughs> I'm trying my secondary only. some more stuff and things. Sometimes Rubber I bending, I yeah. Going, then I punch myself in the nose. <laughs> using a lot of your guides as well? Oh, awesome. I hope they can help you out. Like feeding a bottomless pit. Uh, my steam is finally working on it, except I have to go to work in about an hour. Oh, I'm sorry, Nova. Hey, I hope you have a great day at work. I hope Steam cooperates for you better. <laughs> oh, okay. It's like, what the heck happened here? But no, this is the machine event that did this. I think I got the majority of it here. And I, wow, there's even more Bismarck. That's cool, I actually need Bismarck. I ran out the other day. I had to go trade some stuff in to get a promotion because my last promotion took like 600. I was thinking crossbow would be my last choice for this, but you're like, okay, I'll take the crossbow. <laughs> oh, might as well. I got bodkin points. They're like one of my favorite overclocks. <laughs> really poking that thing, isn't he? There we go. 
<laughs> Petition to rename Alpaca Blooms to Alpaca Blooms. <laughs> I don't know if alpacas exist in this world slash this universe. Maybe alpacas are banned or something. They're illegal. They go for the egg. Okay, well, I mean, I guess we could potentially clear up the swarm with this. points they're so nice Bolts, though. <laughs> Come on, I need some new gear. On, ready. I got first blood with a gutter. Fantastic. No cores. Oh. I'm taking some of the ammo. Yeah. My question just invisible, or can others see it? Um, Getting supplies. I don't know, Frosty. <laughs> Steam when it does that on the worst possible times, yeah. If I'm lucky, I might be able to get into the next round for one round if somebody leaves. Oh, okay. I found some red sugar. Um. Seen a... Oh, there's an egg up here. It's just in a weird spot. Uh, by the way, what happens if all weapon modules... Oh, if you have all weapon modules and can't have another one, but event would give you... So, like, if you have everything, um, then I think it just gives you materials. So you'll get, like, an overclock, but it will just be for, like, so many raw materials. Like if you have all the cosmetics and all the weapon overclocks. Beg your trade, Jeff. I'll fight you normally, <laughs> just with a pickaxe.
Cosmetics show up to give all the weapon over clocks. That is true, yes. I'm banned for saying Deep Rock is good. Hey, Vicky. <laughs> yeah, I know. I seen one <laughs> real sarcastic post the other day that was kind of funny for uh, Deep Rock. I think it was on Steam. It was like, what the heck, does Deep Rock or the Deep Rock devs not know how to actually like sell a game? You don't just keep adding free stuff to it. You don't, you know, get to put it all behind walls of, you know, paying for everything. Oh yeah. Otherwise, why would anybody want to leave your game or whatever? <laughs> You're just providing them more free value. Ooh, I think Ice might have lagged out. He was really glitching there in that last fight. Or maybe he disconnected himself. My game appears to have crashed. Oh, okay. That would explain it. Yeah, that last fight I seen, your dwarf was just kind of... Wow, that is an odd spot for it to be. Your workforce is about to get bigger. Dwarf inbound. Hey, I actually found it. Completely by accident, but I found it. Hey, I made it. Welcome, Nova. Glad you can make it for this mission. Rock and stone. All That was my last bolt. <laughs> Some more bolts. I'll beat your record this time. Just watch the YouTube. Um, Rock and Stone! Yeah! yeah. Rock and Stone! Is that Well, thank you, Nova. <laughs> I have you to thank for it. I think we gotta go down here now. But what about your season pass? Exactly, it's completely free, what the heck? <laughs> and they're actually obtainable even afterwards? You don't even have exclusive things? <laughs> or a loot crate system or anything? Yeah, it's gotta be... somewhere over here. I honestly like that there's a lot of free stuff in Deep Rock. I really do too. That is really nice. And I'm perfectly fine with the way they do DLCs too. Like, if you're doing DLCs and they're cosmetic, no issues. Even if they're like big update DLCs for new stuff, I don't usually have a problem with them as long as you're getting something. And you know the game, well like this isn't really a competitive game, so you don't get an advantage for buying any other thing unless you're doing like war fashion contests or something. Okay. I was made for mining. I'm ready. <laughs> yeah, that'll do it.
they aren't EA, they wouldn't make the pass paid. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But EA was the same company who put, what is it, microtransactions in a single player game like. This is it, team, do us proud. Uh, Rock and roll and stone! The Rock and Stone! Rock and Stone! Yeah. That was Dead Space 3. That was really weird. It's like, it's a single or co op. <laughs> Survival horror game with microtransactions, just buy stuff, like buy different areas. That is so bizarre. Hey, little bugs. Alright, well, crossbow only challenge worked out pretty well. Although, vodka points are pretty awesome. They certainly helped. Why they didn't use the mouse wheel to change map size? <laughs> I like to zoom in. Well, I mean you can, but no lost gear. There was lost gear, but I forgot to get it. I have all the lost gear anyway, so it's not super useful to me. But probably should have got it for the other teammates. We don't want ghost ships to turn into pop cap. <laughs> yeah. That's like every single player game now, though. Uh, some of them. I mean, Elden Ring didn't have it. El <laughs> but then FromSoft is one of the few companies that releases like a full game. It's just like, yep, here you go. 